Hi guys, it's Night Fear, and I am coming on to do my um, hashtag 50 a day November, or NOV, NOV, um, for Monday, no, I'm sorry, for Tuesday the 13th and Wednesday the 14th. So Tuesday the 13th, I was not really in the mood to read. I had finished um, three books on Monday, so I just, uh, I was kind of in a kind of mood, and so I just read, um, some of The Dark Descent of Elizabeth Frankenstein by Kirsten White, um, I ended up reading just 68 pages in that, just so I could have my 50 pages done, basically, I just was not in the mood to read, so, yeah, that was kind of a, eh, kind of a day, then yesterday, I finished this, The Dark Descent of Elizabeth Frankenstein, by, uh, excuse me, um, I finished uh, 148 pages, which was the last of it. This book was excellent. I gave it five stars. Um, it, I don't know, I've never read Frankenstein, so I can't compare it. I'm sorry um, that I can't do that for you, but if Frankenstein is anything like this book, I really am missing out. I really need to read it. Um... But this was just, it was kind of creepy, and it was, you know, there were a little bit of some twists that I didn't quite see, um, and I really, really enjoyed it, and um, I loved the ending, actually. Um, it, it, it made me want more, <laughs> but I'm not, <clears throat> I don't think this is going to be a series, so... <clears throat> but I definitely wanted more the way this ended. So I definitely would recommend this, especially if you like creepy, dark books. Um, and I would recommend the audiobook. I did not listen to the last part of this in audiobook because I can read it faster. Um, and usually I listen to the audiobook if I want to like color or craft or do something else. And I was just wanting to just read. So I just, I finished this. So, there's another one finished. And then I really have been wanting to read this book. So, I read this whole thing yesterday, and it is 165 pages. It's Wraith by Joe Hill. This continue. well, no, it doesn't continue. It tells, it's like a prequel to Nosferatu, but I would definitely recommend reading Nosferatu before you read this, because if you read this first, you're going to spoil some of the, the, the little twists in Nosferatu. So I definitely would read that first and then read this. Um, but this tells um, why Charlie Manx ended up in Christmas Land and kind of how the car works a little bit more. Um, there are some prisoners that end up, you know, getting sucked into to Christmas Land. See, there's some Christmas Land. So yeah, it's it is so good so i really enjoyed it love the art just really really enjoyed this book i also gave this five stars so uh yesterday i read a total of 313 pages so today i am devoting some time to my nonfiction books that i've kind of not been reading lately because i've had some other things i wanted to read and then tomorrow Tome Topple starts, and then I have two fantasy readathons. One starts Saturday, one starts Sunday. So I'll be doing my TBRs for all of those. Um, hopefully today, I was trying to get all the books from the library first before I did my TBRs, and I think all the ones I need, I think I have one or two more on hold, but there are, people are reading them, so I have to wait. So, and then I got a, I found two books for Tome Topple. I, I wanted to find one more, so we'll see. But anyway, today is going to be a nonfiction. I'm going to try to finish up the West Virginia book. I'm going to try to finish up the reading one. I think I've only got 80 pages in, in that one. Um, so I'm going to try to finish those two and maybe start another one. Um, because I really like to get through most of the challenges in nonfiction November. So I also still need to, f to, um, film my Lollathon wrap up. Um, so yeah, I'm getting behind, but anyway, I just wanted to share this cause these two are going back to the library today. Sorry guys about my phone. It's probably, it's either, um, stuff from YouTube or stuff from Twitter, one or the other. So, but anyway, um, 
if you like, like I said, if you, you know, like horror, definitely check out Nosferatu and Wraith by Joe Hill. Um, and if you like, you know, creepy, definitely The Dark Descent of Elizabeth Frankenstein by Kirsten White. So, all right, guys, uh, thank you very much. Please always remember to be kind to each other, and I'll see you next time. Bye.